Greetings to you, beautiful energy. Thanks for tuning in to your entertaining tarot card messages. Take what resonates with you. All of your support is abundantly appreciated. I really appreciate you being along on this journey. I love you. Thank you so much. All right, so good news is going to come in to you early and fast. And I have this feeling like it will be something that you want to hear. This is about money. Um, methods, skills, timing, partnership. I also think you should act fast and think quickly because you could be procrastinating, delaying, wasting time for no reason. Maybe not no reason, but some fear energies are not trusting a person or a situation. So let's see if you should trust. Should Cancerian trust this connection? We have... Um, trust your instincts. Go with the flow of how you feel about this situation. Or going, use your knowledge. What do you know to be true? Evidence, facts, details, ask questions. So going with your instincts is like when you ask enough questions until you're sure about what feels right for you. So sometimes you're uncertain and there's room for you to know more so you can ask some ask some questions and that will help you to making help you to get closer to making some decision your eight of swords is your first card because i feel like you may be sleeping or there's something going on behind the scenes that you did not you don't know about this has something to do with your family i hear meager or like a, ma a meager dog in some way or a dog, a greedy dog and a bone. There's something about your effort, your skills and your gifts, your psychic abilities, your seer, your, um, your, your dreams, your visions, your seer, your sage abilities. Okay, there's something about these things. That you need to pay attention to. You need to know some things that's going on behind the scenes. You are like a black sheep or like a lamb in a sense right now. If you were going through some um, jail time spiritually. Some being um, on lockdown or on hold. You're about, you're about to be free if you felt bound. Because you're about to be released as some truth is coming out. All right, some truth is coming out. Yeah, the high priestess, clairvoyance. This is what I was talking about. Your natural psychic abilities and gifts. Something about unique or union or your mother or chemistry or someone's name. Like an old friend, an old ex, someone maybe older than you. It has something to do with what you don't know. Wolf in sheep's clothing or someone is thinking that you're naive and you won't find something out. I feel like this person could be doing moon magic or water spells and they, they laugh in your face as well. I am getting that this person is nervous though. Because you're coming closer and closer to finding out the truth and speaking the truth, knowing the truth, even though they try to keep you, they try to keep you distracted and like they try to keep information from you, knowledge, power. They locked it away. Um, they didn't. Someone did not want you to see the truth with this card and the eight of swords, the seven of cups. They wanted to delay you. They wanted to keep you waiting and waiting and believing ideally or believing in some ideals that were not serving you. But you are cutting cards and this person is feeling the disconnection. This person is feeling like you're no longer listening to them, following their words, taking their telling, going along with them. This person is realizing that you're questioning things. You're asking back questions. You're speaking up for yourself. There's a, I heard juvenile. Someone was thinking that you wouldn't speak up for yourself. None at all. I'm telling you, someone thought, I hear quip, quip. You're maybe quick thinking. Someone did not expect that you would speak, have a voice. It's like they thought that you were an inanimate object and they would just take you along with them. Or you would just be in agreement with them. You know, but when they heard you start to say, you put, you put your finger up, you're like, excuse me, 
I have a question and then you start to ask your questions and you start to relay information and, and you start to say but so and so but so and so you may have even started to take notes to, to match up the thing and see if the maths work out just to be sure this person they were not expecting that they're kind of sitting here baffled because they weren't expecting you to take your best interest at heart this is something about a deal this could be about insurance or something that some you are involved in but someone just did not think that you would you would have a say in the matter and all this time you're there being quiet listening and waiting for the right time um at the right time the, the to, to 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 have your input okay <clears throat> yeah to have your say yeah this person they felt offended by that they they would be like i can't believe you did that that was unexpected i this person they may walk around with a briefcase or this must mean that they act business like and official or they're doing some paperwork and stuff like that for some of you i'm getting if paperwork is being drawn up it is in your favor something about your mouthpiece or a mouthpiece yeah, it's in your favor. Look at that. It must it must be. It has to be in your favor. Something has to be done right. While shuffling, I glimpsed the justice card a couple times. Something must, you must get what is yours. You're seeing to that. Liberation and success, right? Someone thought that maybe, like, you just outsmart these, these vibrations. You outplayed um, all this time. Queen of Diamonds, you made it all the way up to the top. You know, to the top, like, I'm at the top of the throne, right? In your kingdom. You knew you were about to have this big success. It's been a big dream of yours for a long time. Maybe to be financially independent, to have your own business. Whatever this huge dream of yours was, you wrote it down and it was recorded. It was heard, Whatever your word was, whatever you you are just you were heard. Your prayers were heard. Your prayers were answered. Yeah. The information that someone that was this person that was trying to keep knowledge and information from you, you got it yourself. You went and did something yourself. You did something independently. You did something your own way. Breaking spells too. Someone thought that they would have outdone you with the books by the books but they didn't realize that you are a epic eccentric nerd you you love details you love money baby this is what i came for for my degree for my masters for my bachelors for my honors for my i came to collect my coins redeem me please my royalties cash me out chiching chilling ling so you earn what you put in the work for. Because when you pray to God, God said, okay, my child, I'll take you there. And it wasn't just dropping out of the sky. You hustled for it. You intended for it. You manifested for it. You put in the work for it. So it's for surely yours. Yeah, cha-ching. Um, something about collecting or collect. So page of cups energy, maybe a water sign. Someone wanting to speak to you or dreaming about you or thinking about you. Page of swords, we have three pages in this message. Page, page, page. This person is watching you and this person is protecting you. You are protected. There's something about you getting sleep. You're very protected. Re you, I think you sleep well too at night. You rest well. Is the energy? There's nothing, nothing resting upon your conscience. There's nothing resting upon you. The three cards. Something about your family. I just feel you are pristine. You're, you're clean. You know, or maybe you should like clean up your energy. You're just, just like you have time on your hands, luxury. Like you, you brush your hair before you go to sleep. You lay down on your pillows and you sleep comfortably. You comfortably. You wake up and you feel relaxed. You feel good. You give thanks. You know, that's the energy I'm seeing you in. Independence. Um, being accountable for yourself. You have certain issues, I would say. 
um but you're you're going to be rich i'm telling you you're making a lot of money don't worry about your money your money is booming you're going to have some opportunities to work out relation relationship issues in your life you're maybe going to get a new house seek a house with a father or a parent or something like that oh my gosh i told you not to worry about it i told you i knew it I th some of you you're gonna get someone to pay your rent <laughs> this is what i'm getting like your father may pay your rent for example like you're god financially you're comfortable you're secure you're also like royal like your father could be rich if this is not your father this could be your significant other someone that really takes care of you financially like always topping you up always giving you money always making sure you're good so you may tell people i'm always good like <laughs> like you know like you check your bank account and there's more money um w deposited in it so you know everything like your money keeps getting deposited to your account from either your parent your father your significant other your businesses you're like i'm good you're making sales too you're making book sales and there's something about someone that you used to date maybe this person was older than you um i don't know what it is maybe they want to work or work with you yeah this person they're thinking about you something about karma yeah i feel like you've done some cleansing in your life too cut some cords leveled up become aware of yourself let a, you've let a lot of things go so that you can sit in the place to earn or to receive what is yours you don't want what is not yours and you see when you receive what is yours it's amazing because all that you want all your dreams all your visions are um, what you want you know is just for you so when you stop wanting what other people want and letting go off of what is not yours and trusting in the most high you're going to see what is yours moving graciously. You're going to be so thankful abundantly into your life. You're opening your arms and you're receiving it like yes. Some of you, you're going to be traveling. You're getting a plane ticket or you're buying one. I'm telling you, you're leveling up luxury. I'm looking at this lady. Her nails are done, her hair, her hair, her eyelashes. She looks like she don't lift a straw. She don't. She works. I can tell that she's busy. She's efficient. She works. She's smart. She's um, practical, logical. She's emotional. She's smart. She's funny, beautiful, graceful, blessed, abundant. You make money easily. You make your life look easy. Is what I'm saying. Effortless because you are blessed. You are anointed. You've been touched by grace. Like like there was a time when most had touched you, acknowledged you, blessed you, and you never forgot about your talents and your gifts because God saw it in you and God appreciated it in you. Or this could be your teachers, your mentors, your spirits, your guides that have acknowledged your talents, your gifts, your abilities, your bountifulness, your soul family. You've been blessed on this journey. There's so much love in this energy for you all over. I feel the only thing is when you you should um the only issue if there is one would be you coming up in alignment with the truth of who you are, all that you've accomplished and just being ready for what is yours and like putting down what is not and just being opening it's like your birthday and someone is walking you have something in your hand random and there's someone walking in a room with your cake with all the candles on your cake and so it's like this moment is beautiful so whatever you were holding in your hands you put that down somewhere on a chair just to embrace this birthday cake and the laughter and the smiles and the happiness and receive your cake receive your rewards that is the energy it, that's how it's coming in for you like it was made for you prepared for you lit up for you and it's coming in in us like a celebration it's only for you to hold your head up and put whatever down in your hand and receive this because it's all yours so take a deep breath and get ready to receive wow judgment card i'm telling you it's a celebration look 
like I was telling you, most I prepared this birthday cake for you know, and is ushering it in. Like, wow, applause and everything. All your angels, your spirits, and your guides. You know why you're getting all these blessings too? Because you believed in yourself. You maintained your vision of self. You saw yourself through. And I'm getting the energy where not a lot of people do this. Not a lot of people make it to the end because they get to a point where they leave their dreams up to the, in the hands of other people. You got to that point and it became difficult, a difficult challenge. And you pushed through and you're getting rewarded. And I say someone is taking flight and you're a beautiful earth angel. And I did say your mentors, your spirits, your guides, like I did mention most high has like touched you, anointed you, blessed you. I was going to say it's like seeing um, your teachers show up and they know that you, you're smart, but they give you that look to make sure that you know that they know that you have the potential in you. So you're to use it. So it's like you're getting an acknowledgement and like recognition from a greater source and they're like hmm, remember you are blessed i've blessed you and you're like yes miss you're like thank you so you're you're going to show up and you show up and you show out it's the energy you're doing well for yourself king of swords i feel like i'm not lying king of swords and the judgment card eight of pentacles you've done so well in, in uh, manifesting your dream, you've all you've had major support around you too, in many different ways. So you should also give back and be grat gr grateful. Yeah, this is like the time where you can pre make your presentation, your speech, as you collect your rewards. I feel like you're going to be blessing your family. You're going to be blessing everyone that has helped you on your journey. You're going to be able to give back in multiple forms. You're going to even be able, you're giving back to yourself. You're, it's like you're crying. You're so fulfilled and happy. That yes, I can pay my, my, I can pay off my debts. I can pay back everyone and I can give to myself. I can finally, I can do something for myself. It's, I promise you. That's the energy. Four of diamonds is your last card. And it's, it's you're seeing through to it. It's being seen to that that is what happens in this energy. And I feel like it has already happened. It's already happened. So, you know, I'm going to leave these messages here. Thanks for tuning in. I'll catch you in the next one. Remember that if these messages inspire you on your journey, I appreciate a thumbs up, a like, a share, a comment. Um, all of your support is abundantly appreciated. And I'm sure support will return onto you multiplied in your own endeavors. Beautiful soul. It is my pleasure and my honor to present for you. Take it easy out there. All is well and all is within you. Next time. Bye.